Welcome to the Cisco Security Video Knowledge Base. This is a video explaining registering and activating accounts for the Cisco Registered Envelope Service, or CRESS for short. When you receive your message using CRESS, it and all other secured messages will be sent in an email similar to any other. However, this email will have an attached file called Secure Doc. This is the actual secured message part of the email. When you open this file for the first time, you will be presented with a screen that looks similar to an envelope, with your email address listed and a prompt informing you to register. Click on the Register button to begin the process. Once you click on the button to register, the new User Registration page will appear. Here you can select your language and fill in your first and last name. You will then create the password that will be used to log into your account and open all secured messages. This password must be a minimum of six characters, must contain at least one number, and is case sensitive. Once created, you will confirm the password in the field below. You will also create a short security phrase which, when enabled, will appear on your envelopes to ensure the message was meant for you. Finally, on this page, you will select or create three security questions for your account, as well as provide the answers for the chosen questions. Once a question is selected, you will provide the answer and confirmation of that answer in the two spaces below. When you have finished filling out the information on this page, click the register button to continue. You will then see the final step page to inform you that the account was created and that a new email will be sent to you to activate this account. Check back in your inbox and you should have an email from Cress Do Not Reply, entitled, Please Activate with Cress. Opening this will inform you that to activate the account and accept the terms of service, you must click on the link that says, click here to activate this account. Once you have done so, you will see a new page telling you that the address has been confirmed and that you can now open your secured message. This can be done by returning to the original email you received and opening the secure doc attachment that first prompted you to register. This time, rather than a prompt to register, you'll be asked to enter in your password and press open to view your secured message. There is a small chance that rather than the normal final step page, you may encounter an error such as the one currently on the screen, telling you that the activation email was not able to be sent. If you receive this error message, or if you are having any other issues and need further assistance, you can always contact a Cisco customer support representative at support at res.cisco.com. Thank you for watching and for using the Cisco Registered Envelope Service. Have a great day.